What's up, YouTube? I'm back. Sorry, I forgot some of my equipment at the Brighton store, so I'm just in my office in Fort Morgan. Um, I wanted to talk about divorce and uh, why men don't want to get married anymore. But first, please like and subscribe. Um, getting better every day, learning new stuff every day. Um, gonna start learning how to do videos and just edit the whole video without having to be here live and start over if I make a mistake and all that kind of stuff. So, anyway. Guys, don't get married. Don't do it. Because look at what happens when you do. This was written March 23rd. Jeff Bezos gave away so much money to his ex-wife that she was able to give away $3.9 billion to 465 nonprofits over the last nine months. Are you fucking kidding me? What woman deserves that? What man deserves that? If you aren't part of the business, you're just a fucking spouse. Why do you deserve half of this man's money? Bottom left corner, Dr. Dre had to write this broad a hundred million dollar check to get her to shut the hell up. Only in America is this kind of shit happening. And well, I should say Western countries. Can a woman marry a man, watch that man bust his fucking ass for 15 years, not help that fucking man, and then in the end when she leaves that man, put her hand out for half of what that man has worked for? Are you fucking kidding me? Gentlemen, don't do it. This is a man that's been married twice. Don't do it. It's not worth it. What are you going to get out of it? What incentive does a man have to be married to a woman? Considering that we're equal now and men are expected to cook and clean just like a woman, what do I need you for? And if I can't cook and clean, I can hire a service. So beyond sex, what does a man really need a woman for? Pretty shitty thing to say, but it's kind of true. It's, it's funny how women sit in a world built by men, made comfortable for them by men, and then say they don't need men. It's kind of crazy to me. Everything, every comfort, every piece of technology that women use was afforded to them by a fucking man. And then here we are, the last 50 years, men ain't shit. Everything you have was given to you by a fucking man. You didn't take it, we gave it to you. These roads you're driving on, this running water you got, this electric, this is all given to you and maintained by men. And then when we marry you, we turn around and get this kind of shit. I hear uh, Will Smith's getting ready to divorce this evil woman, Jada Pickett Smith. She's a fucking evil woman. Wow. He's going to have to give up $350 million to this evil woman. $350 million. Now, if you're rich like these guys, you know, I've heard Chris Rock say it. It's really not that big deal. Uh, Jeff Bezos obviously had $16 billion. He gave his old lady eight. That still leaves him with $8 billion. Plus, he was able to make that money back during the pandemic. But if you're just a normal dude out here and you make... 50 grand a year and your ex-wife wants 20 fucking five and child support what the fuck are you gonna live on you only make 50 they're taking 35 before you even get taxed so what the hell is a man supposed to live on after a divorce oh well sir you got kids out of it did i no because the courts helped my ex-wife take the kids so in the end there's no reason for a man to get married. Sorry, there just isn't. The system is built to fleece men. Well, I just was just in divorce court last month in, in March, and everybody in the room was getting paid but me. Seriously, every individual in the room was getting paid but me, and I was paying most of them. So why would a man sign up for that? I'll say it again. They'll tell you, oh, well, you get kids out of it. No, you don't. No, you don't. Because the system is going to help your ex-wife take the kids. So you don't get shit out of it. What does a woman get? Oh, well, she gets benefit of the doubt in court. She gets 97% uh, of alimony goes to women. I think 80% of child support goes to women. I think over 80% of custody goes to women. 
The house usually goes to the woman. Right? We're equals, but I still got to pay you after we break up. No, 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 no. Gentlemen, it is time for us to band together and talk to younger gentlemen and tell them, do not get married until you see the legislature change in your state. That's right. We all as men have to go and look at the laws in our state and fight them for the benefit of our sons. I have a 10-year-old son. Sorry about that. My phone's tripping. I have a 10-year-old son. I promise you by the time he's 14, that nigga will be in a uh, child support court watching and listening. I promise you. He's going to know. And I challenge every man out here with a son to sit this son down and show him this. But I got to get back to work, guys. It's nice talking to you today. I'll be back tomorrow with something else. I've got something I'm working on. Um, have a good week. Have a good night because I'm going to see you tomorrow. Please like and subscribe. Um, I appreciate everybody that has so far. I've got 10 subscribers. I thank all 10 of you. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe. You guys have a good night.